Hello, my name is David Nelson Brown and I'm a volunteer on the Bobbin and Wentford Railway. I'm sure you're watching this as you're interested in how you can help us in these difficult times. As chairman of our operating company, it is my job to steer the railway through these financially turbulent times and ensure we're in a good shape, ready to start offering services again as soon as we're allowed. But what is the Bobbin and Wentford Railway? And why is it so important to save in these troubled times? Well, it's more than a train set. It's living history, a piece of national and local cultural heritage. It's a welcoming place for people of all walks of life to come together with a common interest. Not all are rail enthusiasts. Some are just enthusiastic about helping others. It's an educational facility. We've helped young people who struggle at school to find purpose and practical skills. We've had apprenticeships. We've retrained retired lawyers in bricklaying and woodwork. We educate, and again, not just about trains. We're one stitch in the fabric of a community of local businesses and local initiatives. We're a growing part of the local economy, supporting over 20 paid positions and bringing hundreds of thousands of pounds into the local economy every year. But right now, we face the biggest financial challenge we've ever had. We spend our money in the winter, repairing and enhancing the attraction. But this summer, we haven't recouped any of that expenditure and the future hangs in the balance. As we celebrate the 75th anniversary of VE Day, we also celebrate 75 years since the publication of the first book about the most famous tank engine in the world. Whilst the Reverend Audrey's railway series was written in stark sermon-like language where engines were punished for disobedience. The underlying themes of the Thomas stories are echoed in today's heritage railways. Kindness, friendship, teamwork, loyalty and a good deal of mischief made up the most famous stories into the worldwide success they remain and have kept them fresh for the modern era. So too, our railway remains relevant and important to today's high-tech society. At this time of national crisis, Heritage Railway volunteers from across the UK have stepped up to work on the big railway as signallers to keep the flow of food and medicine moving around the country. Those Heritage Railway volunteers have learnt their craft at places like Bodmin and we want to keep doing that for many years to come. Our railway has not only given retired railwaymen somewhere to go, we have bred the next generation of railwaymen. I have been involved at Bobbin all of my life, and my involvement led me to a career, including a time at Network Rail Head Office, and now to own my own railway. The Bobbin Railway is so much more than a collection of trains, and we need your help to keep doing our good work for many years to come. If you're able to support, please visit bobbinrailway.co.uk to learn more about our crowdfunding campaign. But please, when we reopen, Come and visit us and bring your friends and find out more about the different ways in which we may already be impacting on your life. Thank you.